but we'll cover spotting right now. So for you, I spotted the bar. I didn't grab his body, right? As soon as I saw it pitch forward and he was gonna miss, I just, I just started to lift the bar. And if you're one person spotting, one lifter, you can do that. Still set your safeties, but you just add the bar. And then we make a deal where he's gonna never quit on me. He's never just gonna go, oh, it's not there. I'm just gonna ride it down. He's gonna be exerting force. So what's the deal? 192 and a half. Last time he did 190. So we know that his strength is right there. So if he misses, he's gonna miss it by like a pound or two of force. So like when I just helped him, I didn't like, it wasn't like, oh, uh, right? It was like, oh, just pull it back. Actually, I just pulled him back into balance and then he came up. If I'm spotting, and we're about to spot Jim, a big heavy load, I want two spotters on each side. And hopefully if, if your gym permits and you have the people, someone that's kind of like monitoring the set. And so Cam and I are spotting and we're not freaking out. We're not every single rep, Ooh, right? Because we know Jim's gonna do five. And what do we know? We know that if Jim has an issue, it's probably gonna be like reps four and five, right? Rep one, probably be okay we're still aware but we're, we're whatever so then jim starts squatting and cam and i just keep our eye on each other and as it starts to slow down we'll see it when it slows down then we can start to kind of come down and be mindful of it and then if he needs a spot if you have someone like in the case you have me today i would say spot right and you guys would look at each other and you would take the crook of your elbow and come up inside the barbell and put your hand on the plate and you would just come up with the plate. Again, Jim's not quitting on us. He's still trying. Come up with the plate and go into the rack. A lot of times when people miss a squat, the spotters freak out. Like they freak out and whoosh, and they try to like grab and put, and then now you have this load doing all kinds of crazy stuff. So just be calm. Like this is a controlled environment. The fact that he's missing his rep, like he may be emotionally upset about it, but he's gonna be okay, right? So like all I need to do He's missing it by two or three pounds. I just need to be in a position to where if he does stop exerting force, I'm in a good intelligent position, but just get into a position where I can guide it up and go into the rack. Does that make sense? All right, cool. Low, low, come down a little bit. Yeah, there you go. All right, let's get Cam and Ian spotting this one. One at a time, Jim. Big breath. Drive, oh yeah, keep your eyes down. Drive your hips up. Good, good. Pause, get set, tight. You got it. Drive, head down. Lean over into it. Drive it up, drive it up. Pause, get set. Let's go, Jim. Chest down. Yep, yep. Awesome. Appreciate it. Awesome.